My journey personally starts 17 years ago, uh, 15 years old. I leave high school. You know, school was never uh, a passion of mine, to say the least. The best lessons for me were learned in life. I've been on a journey for many years. I've tried a lot of things from trades through e-commerce. Through the experience through e-commerce, I find myself working with people to develop their own brands. I also get exposed to manufacturing and also get the courage to take a journey, you know, at the age of 30 and also finding the news that I'm about to have my fourth child. I'm a proud father of uh, four, four children. Christian Paul's my eight-year-old son. He's my second, second eldest. With our logo, the C starts on uh, 11 and it finishes on five, uh, which represents 11.25. And on the 13th of July in 2008, at 11.25 a.m., I was lucky enough to welcome a child into the world uh, and name him after my father and my wife's grandfather. The mission for Christian Paul, I, I believe is quite simple. The outcome of Christian Paul is to become uh, Australia's most well-known international watch brand. You know, I believe, you know, if you've got a wrist, we've got a watch that can fit it. One of the philosophies behind Christian Paul is affordable luxury with um, sophisticated simplicity. Marble for me is a, it's a material that's timeless. Growing up in a, in a European household, uh, marble was quite dominant in my upbringing. I even think back and still wonder today why there wasn't marble in my bedroom. As far as the design, the uniqueness in the design, the face, it's definitely a strong part of the brand. Even though my latest collection, the Raw, is about stripping back from the face and just getting into the DNA of the actual, uh, the profile of the case, also the straps uh, down to the texture uh, in the, the leather to the, the metal in our mesh bands. Having interchangeable straps, that's definitely a key element in, in the design to be able to uh, design an outfit around the watch or to complement an, an outfit with the watch. Another thing I also think about in design is a different point of views. So that be uh, seeing someone from a distance, seeing someone up close. And then obviously as the, the person that wears the watch, I like to look at those uh, visual points in the design. So, you know, front, side profile, uh, how you'd look at the watch, telling the time. We normally start the process uh, sketching on paper. Uh, from there, we move into a, a CAD design that will then move, be moved into a, a 3D printer where we'll print the, the case to one-to-one -one ratio. We actually clip our bands on to the case, print it out of the 3D printer, and then that moves us through to the person wearing the watch's perspective, an audience's perspective of seeing the watch at different distances uh, to make sure we get a, a mix of being a, a feature and being an accessory. An idea that was fabricated in my lounge room at home to a brand that's out there right now representing Australia internationally. At the moment, it's sold in approximately 27 countries. Things have changed uh, dramatically and uh, I'm very grateful for that. Because the biggest challenge for me is what's next? You know, I think as, a, as the CEO um, and as the visionary, uh, it's very important to obviously not lose track of where we are today, where we'll be tomorrow, but more importantly, think of who we are, making sure that's aligned with who we want to be and making sure that it's a brand that's got longevity. That's obviously ironic. We're making timepieces. We want to be around for a long time.
my favourite part about being involved in Christian Paul is now I've got to focus. I feel like I've personally found found my way and also show my kids that when you've got a vision, you should commit yourself, you know, 100%. Our business plan is to be uh, better today than we were yesterday, and be better uh, tomorrow than we, we were today. Uh, more importantly, for me personally, uh, a brand that I can hand over to my, my children one day. It's what makes me excited.